I just finished uh, downloading SUSE and it says right here um, MD5 checks check for the integrity of the download and it says expert only you don't actually have to be an expert to do this I'm going to show you two ways one is with uh, a GUI you know user friendly way and then a terminal if you know you want to use a terminal uh, but I'm not going to use the open source uh, DVD that I got I'm just going to use um, some other distro but it's the same shit you know. well first you need to uh, fire up um, Ace Tone ISO this program and all you gotta do is um you know look at the image that you you're using in this case I'm gonna use um puppy Linux um this ISO here and you see there's um they you know when you download something they give you a MD5 uh, file basically what it is is just a text file when you open it <coughs> when you open it, it looks something like this inside see it gives you a, a number this number has to uh, match what the ISO is so just let me do it and then you get the idea of what it does um, using ISO, uh, I stone ISO 2 here all you gotta do is um, go to utilities and this is MD5 uh, summer here right and all you gotta do is check and then it tells you to um, choose the ISO that you're looking for. So we're doing Puppy Linux, right? So you open it and you wait for a bit, and then it should tell you this thing, right? See, it tells you the number um, here. This shit. And um, you want to make sure that it matches with uh, what they give you. They usually give you a file or something on the s the website. See, like this. Uh, in this case, we're just gonna look at the first um, uh, three letters, three characters in the front, and three characters in the back. So, seven B C, and then E seven F front. Seven B C, E seven F. So it's the same shit, all right. So we know that's a valid um, uh, ISO image. And uh, let's say they don't, they don't, you know, give you an MD5 file, you know, file to download. So in this case, I'm gonna use a uh, PC Flexbox here. They only give you a a number, this number right here, right? Right here, this is the the checksum number. So all you're just gonna copy that, right? And um, you're gonna create a new file. Uh, where your um, you know, your image is at. See, this is the mini flux uh, file. So all you gotta do is um, create a new document. Right. And you wanna open it. Let's see, and you wanna paste that in there. And then you're gonna give it like two spaces, two. And then you need to copy the name of um the mini flux to the ISO thing copy it right. and then paste it in and it's an ISO so you want to type ISO so that's all you gotta do save it right and we need to rename um, the file to the file name to and then rename it to um, well, it's on dot ISO, ISO, and then you have to put MD5, and you see the name matches up with the um, your ISO image. See, this one and this one. The only difference is um, it has a dot MD5 here. <coughs> so that's how you create um, MD5 um, file to um, check. And what we're gonna do with this file is uh we're gonna use a, a terminal. Terminal to check it. No. This is uh the method too I'm talking about. So I don't actually need this anymore, but with the terminal, um you want to go change directory.
right to this um, directory here. So I'm just gonna copy this. Right, this is our directory. So if you go using our terminal here. You go cd. That means change folder or go to that fucking folder. So this is the folder we're looking. F we're going to my parking folder. Right. <coughs> And then the command is uh, what is the command? Oh yeah, MD5 some. What the hell? MD5 some space dash c. <coughs> and then all you gotta do is um, either no, the simple way is just to drag the MD5 file here, right? You wanna drag it in there? That's the easy way. And then just execute. Right. And you wait. And then you see it says OK. And that means it's good. Because the, the numbers matches with the, the ISO. And that's how you check it. Um, that's, that's how easy it is. You know, with the ace tone, and uh, this is with the terminal. So you don't have to be a fucking expert to do this, um, regardless of what they say. That's all.